In this video, I will review all the formulas you need for projectile motion. Projectile motion has an X component and a Y component. So we will start by looking at the X component. The X component is uniform motion. So the acceleration is equal to zero. And we can use the uniform motion equation, which says that VX is equal to delta X divided by delta T. And for an object that is thrown up into the air, Vx is equal to V cos theta. Now let's look at the y component. The y component is free fall motion, which means you can use the kinematic equation. These are the kinematic equations with the y variable. And since the y component represents free fall motion, the acceleration is equal to negative 9.8 meters per second squared. And for an object that is thrown up into the air, the initial velocity in the y component is equal to v sine theta. And if you are asked to find the final velocity, you have to use this equation, which says that vf is equal to the square root of vx squared plus vfy squared. In order to find the angle of this final velocity vector, you have to use theta is equal to tan inverse of vfy divided by vx. And those are the main formulas and variables that you need to answer projectile motion questions.